What's going on guys, it's LQG, and today I'm back with another video. So today we're going to be taking a look at some NBA legends explaining why Michael Jordan is the greatest of all time. Now I'm not going to say too much, we're going to get right into this, but make sure you guys smash the like button, let's see if we can hit 100 likes on this video. Also make sure you guys subscribe to catch all the new content, we are releasing daily videos on this channel so you don't want to miss out. And in the comments, let me know who your GOAT is and why. If it's Jordan, let me know why, and if it's someone else, let me know as well. So with that being said, let's get into the video. <laughs> I in the stands that never had a chance to see me play for the first time, and I want to make sure that they go home and they see the best of me. The statue of limitations up. I was terrified out there. Were you really? Yeah. You just got a MJ? Yeah. You gave for him how 20? long? For how long? Right when you took the floor? Oh, or? the whole game. It's one, he's a greatest player. Two, I was worried about him dunking on me and I have to go back and, you know, oh, face yeah, the yeah. fellas. And then three, he was just so hot. I was like, man, this dude, like, the stuff that I saw when I was in college on TV, it's, it's like really real. I was terrified. <laughs> I mean, but, you know, when I got the ball and saw those bums they had playing me, you know, I was going to go to work. Bums. Yeah, bums. They had been playing, brother. Bums. You know what I'm saying? They so, but anyway, like, just watching them out there, I was terrified. It's a great feeling to know that, you, that your team has confidence in you and that you're going to get the ball in those situations, and you really want the basketball. I kind of felt a little bit like Michael, although I never could do the things that Michael can do, but Michael feels that he can do whatever he wants, and you're in, in some sort of a different zone when you're out there. How we played or how we acted. He is cut from the same mold as Magic Johnson, and when I say that, and it's on the court. To come out of my chest, and I'm just praying that, that he just shoots a fadeaway jump shot. But he decided to go baseline, and when he went to jump, all I could think about, this cannot be a highlight. And uh, he just did like a little reverse layup, and as he came down and started running back, he just looked back and winked at me. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I, I thought, oh man, this could, this could be a long night. He enjoyed guarding Mike, because he was, you know, the one thing I did with Mike, because I never got him pissed off. You know, that's <laughs> he make a shot, you say, good shot, Mike. You know, you don't talk trash to him so he can go off for 60, you know. You try to kill him with kindness, yeah. you don't try to talk trash to him. So they're getting off the bus, we're done with shoot around and we're walking out and MJ says, B Scott, what's going on? I said, what's up MJ? He said, man, I, I hear that you're not playing tonight. No, I sprained my ankle. He said, who's guarding? I said, Anthony Peeler. He said, 50. <laughs> <laughs> so I told Anthony Peeler, listen, uh, MJ, uh, He's probably going to go for about 50 tonight on you, so just <laughs> don't don't piss him off, you know, just be cool. He, en he ended up with 54. <laughs> so uh, the man could do basically whatever he wanted to do on that basketball court. The first time you faced Jordan, what was that, 93? Yeah, uh, <laughs> I remember the first time I faced Jordan, but how about this? We're playing him, I think it's the year they won 72 games, I don't know. But he's sitting in the... He's sitting in the arena on his Ferrari. And I, I think I told somebody this, but this is the only time I let a teammate down. I feel like I threw a teammate out the bus. So I'm getting off the game. It's game three or game two. We're playing in the arena, and he's in the arena smoking a cigar. He's smoking a freaking cigar before the game. He's just over. So Jawan and I get off the bus, and, uh, and he's like, yo, who's checking me today? And this is when you're supposed to say, man, shut up, man. We're about to, we about to beat y'all. So Calvin Chaney walks on off the bus after this, and we all look back like uh, this would be. You got to go with Jordan. I, I didn't guard Jordan a lot, but when I did, it was definitely Jordan. Good looking. All right, your Jordan story so, before we take a break. So, Jordan, I'm playing in Orlando. It's his last year. We play them in Orlando first, and I'm blocking his shot. Like, I'm locking him up. Like, oh, he, I'm, oh. I'm, I'm doing my thing again. I blocked his shot like three or four times. Oh. Like, I'm having my way against him. Definitely. He tells me I'm done. Like, my ankles, you know, once again, it's, it's not healed. It's broken. I have to have surgery. But I wanted to play against Jordan one last time. And so we're playing the Wizards. On, it's a TNT game. Wait, Thursday don't you night. want to go out where you dominate him yeah, and you're blocking I mean, his well, shots? I'm just thinking, you know, my ego. Like, I'm oh, thinking, like, okay. I had him the last game. Yeah. I, I don't need this little ankle. Just give me some, like, give me some. I only uh, need Motrin. one ankle. Give me yeah. a bunch of Motrin. Okay. I'm going to go out here. And when I tell you, he torched me in that first quarter. Like, literally, he gave me 20 points in the first quarter on the same play. Like, he just ran the same play every time and did this, like, you know, and I could not guard him. And so, literally, I, I checked out of the game at the end of the first quarter, and I didn't even go to the bed. I just walked 
back to the locker room. <laughs> like, I was done. Like, literally had surgery, like, a couple days later. But it was like, I wanted to guard Jordan one last time. And you're right, I shouldn't have. I should have just let that go. Did he know you were a wounded animal? He probably did, because he went at me every... And he and, didn't and the care. the same move. Like, it wasn't... He didn't do anything different. It was the same move. And I had nothing... F- 